Major Hayward, officers, warrant officers, non-commissioned officers and guardsmen of the Queen's Company. I am very pleased to present the new colour to my company here today. King Charles II, whose bronze effigy now surveys this parade, first ordered that a colour should be given to the first company of his first regiment of guards, and that that company should be known as the King's Company. Since that time, a new colour has been given by successive sovereigns to their own company. I am proud to carry on this tradition, which has been maintained for nearly three centuries by my predecessors. It gives me special pleasure in view of my close association with your regiment as its colonel for 10 years. As its colonel-in-chief, I still follow all its activities with great interest. The Sovereign's Company is perhaps specially connected with the important ceremonial duties which it by custom discharges on great and solemn occasions in our history. I have sacred memories of the reverent care shown by the bearer parties from my company at the funerals of my father and grandmother. But your tasks do not end there, nor is your position at the right, on the right of the line of British infantry due solely to your preeminence in ceremonial drill. It is justified by the record of the company and of the regiment in the field, which is indeed second to none. When, at the end of this year, you go overseas to Germany, I know that you will maintain the high standard that has always been expected of the Sovereign's Company of the 1st Battalion Grenadier Guards. I now commit this colour to your charge, confident that you will guard and honour it as the symbol of your loyalty and devotion, and of my personal trust in each one of you as a member of the company which bears my name. 